What's up everybody, it's your boy Meme here. Uh, so today, uh, I'm gonna be talking about... Oh, right, you may be wondering what's in the thumbnail. And that's, <laughs> if I remember to put it in the video. It's, um... Okay, so, it's a long story, right? On my way back... So basically, when I go down to the treadmill, I have to bring my fan, my headphones, my headphone wire, my water bottle, my... Uh, okay. The tablet, my headphones, the headphone wire, um, my water bottle, the fan, and I think that's a, that's my parents' show, I apologize. Um, and the crazy thing is that, uh, carrying all of this one time, uh, I think it was a week ago, about, uh, I was holding the tablet here, it fell out of my arm, walking back, um, you know, I was downstairs in the garage, and I was walking back, and, uh, it's, it's, it was horrible, because I didn't realize anything of it at the time, I didn't think about it at the time, however, um, turns out the, the tablet, right, it hit in just a way, it has a case on it, it hit in just a way to where it just crumpled the headphone jack. It's like, th there was a headphone jack, and then it just like, <laughs> why did it do that? Um, and also the screen, it gets, it gets kind of yellow near the corner. I don't mind that as much, because you cannot tell unless it's completely pitch black dark on it. But, uh, yeah, it's, it's really irritating. Um, and so I had to just go on the treadmill with no sound, or no videos, or anything whatsoever for like, I think two days. And then we got this um, adapter. I actually have, I bought two adapters. Um, and they're actually really high quality. They're in this box here. Um, well, one of them is in this box. I'm gonna tell you where the other one is once I finish this story. Here we go. Um, yeah, uh, really nice adapter. Uh, this one, it kind of holds its form, but not really, barely, right? Uh, it's super malleable, it's super nice. It's braided, it's a braided cable. Uh, these tips are metal, and I really like how the headphone part of the headphone jack just kind of goes out a tiny bit with the red. Um, and uh, this is generally a really high quality cable. I think I got this for uh, 13 bucks for both of them, uh, which, you know, may seem like a lot, but I'm going to be using these and having these for the rest of my life. So, uh, you know, I might as well get it right the first time, right? Um, anyways, so I realized... Um, I, I, yeah, so I, I got this. I, I got this, and I've been watching video. However, uh, just to be careful with the tablet, I've been doing it in two, two going up and down. Uh, I bring my fan first, and then I bring everything else. Uh, because the fan is the main issue. It's this big old box fan. I actually have it right here. I don't know if you can... This, I have to bring this. And so... Um, yeah, and then I realized, oh, I can just, instead of having the tablet up here and charging and having my headphone wire up here and charging and everything, um, I could just have everything downstairs. I could have my tablet, the adapter, like the dongle, the headphone wire that isn't this one. It doesn't, it's like this, except it doesn't have the braid. Uh, downstairs, charging, and then, uh, like in the garage. And then um, I could just go down there with just the fan and just my headphones and my phone and my water, right? Yeah, uh, just with those. And uh, I won't have to bring the tablet down, which is really, really, really awesome because it means there's like almost zero chance anything can happen with it now. Um, so yeah, that that's what it is. It's uh, my my phone, no, the tablet sitting on a table charger uh, with the dongle and the, uh, the headphone wire. Um, you know, do you want to something crazy? Do you want to something goofy and wacky? Um, um, sorry, I just saw this, can you see my armpits? Am I sweating? No. Uh, sorry, I just saw, like, the stupidest thumbnail of all time. It's so stupid. I know that the thumbnail meta is to just be super dumb and stupid with, especially with the titles. Oh my god. Ah, um, you go on my Thou Chives channel. I might change this because, uh, to be honest, I kind of want more views on my Thou Chives channel. I feel like I'm making the best gameplay videos right now. Um, of just any, of just anybody, at least in 1080p 60 frames per second. And, uh, as you could tell, I named my videos just TV Kid Gameplay number four, TV Kid Gameplay number three, TV Kid Gameplay number two, um, Death Stranding Gameplay number three, Death Stranding Gameplay number four, Death Stranding Gameplay number five, um, Noida Gameplay number one. Well, it actually started with number zero on Noida. Noida Gameplay number one. Number... Uh, Noida gameplay number two, and uh, I just have it like that. However, um, oh God, I see a lot of these gameplay channels being like, 
Half-Life 2, 60 frames per second, 1080, uh, 1080p, highest quality, um, no commentary in, like, the entire title, and, um, you know, I get it, like, it pushes it up in the algorithm when you search, like, Half-Life 2, playthrough, no commentary, but, uh, god, it's just so annoying. Um, you know, it's not my, like, the best, um, this probably isn't great if you're editing, like, if you're editing and you download a video from YouTube and you try and put it in your thing, but I really like it whenever, like, a Half-Life 2 playthrough is just, like, one video and it's, like, 12 hours. Great stuff. Yeah, I, and it, oh, and they have the tiny stamps in the description. It's awesome. Um, I don't know. I'm trying not to do gameplay videos of things like Half-Life, though. Uh, because, you know, everybody's recorded Half-Life. Somebody's probably recorded it in, like, 8K, 60 frames per second. And uh, I can't top that, right? YouTube physically can't top that. Uh, I think you can only go up to 8K on YouTube. And uh, so my plan, the plan, right, ideally, hopefully, if I get around to it, um, I'll go to itch.io and just record like gameplay of just games that just came out like a few seconds ago and that look decent so then uh not only will i i have a full monopoly on gameplay video of the video game like how i do with tv kit right now um i'll also um whenever anybody sees a game that they like and they search gameplay of it like i'll be the first one to show up and i'll be it i'll be all of the content of it on youtube except for the trailer or something i suppose so yeah, you know, I've uploaded four, and the nice thing is, you know, uh, <laughs> the reason why I think I have the best gameplay, at least 1080p 60 frames per second gameplay, sorry about that, uh, I just paused, and I played a positive video, let me turn off my desktop audio, um, is because it's Creative Commons, which means I literally, physically, actually cannot copyright strike you if you use my content. I, I can't. Um, you know, I, I, this has happened with some music, I don't know if it's happened with YouTube videos. Uh, if you have a standard YouTube license and somebody uses your content, like the content with a standard YouTube license, I think you can copyright strike them, and then you get all the revenue from the video. Uh, however, Creative Commons means no matter what, no matter what happens in the future, I, I cannot, I can't do that. Uh, which is really nice because it means it's, it's not only, um, it's like future me proof. And who knows what future me is going to think, but future me can't change this content, okay? Ideally, you know, I would um, have a YouTube channel with like a random password and then I just upload one gameplay video and then I have a new YouTube channel with a random password that I don't remember. So then, you know, I can't even delete the videos, but you know, I can't, I can't do that sadly because that'd be horrible for the algorithm. Uh, God, I don't know. I, di I dislike all this algorithm talk. I dislike uh, doing all these stupid things, but um, you know, uh, God, even... <laughs> It, in the description of my Thou Types TV Kid gameplay, I've put uh, TV TV Kid comma game comma video game comma Astrosist comma TV Kid game comma TV Kid video game comma playthrough comma gameplay comma TV Kid gameplay comma TV Kid playthrough comma like that, um, and you know it's really brought up my search results, but um, it's just it's just so annoying. It's so irritating to do that. Um, yeah, I I don't know. I, I try to keep my content, at least on Thou Tribes, um, as not intrusive and as not annoying as possible, but I might have to in the future um, if I want to get people using my content. Um, I even say at the top of the description, free, free to use in any content, no credit required. So uh, as far as I know, I've already helped one person with their TV kid gameplay. Uh, they, they did a review and they used my gameplay. And uh, you know, <laughs> commented with the Thou Tribes name, uh, thank you for using my content. Um, for the record, it's free for anybody to use and you don't even need to credit me. Uh, but, something like that. But he deleted the comment, so I don't, know, I don't know, maybe he's ashamed of using my content even though it says it right there in the description. Um, yeah, so that's the Thou Types plan, and uh, you know, it's probably not gonna happen. I'm, pr I'm pretty lazy, I'm probably not gonna do anything with it. But, uh, you know, yeah. Alright, see ya, dude. Also, um, I also hate doing this, but like your own videos. It's, um... It, it brings it up, no joke. All right, see you, dude.